At a dairy farm in Vermont, the cows are doing what they do best, standing still, chewing their cud, and producing poop. They're also a source of electricity that is powering this nearby t-shirt factory. The business pays a premium to the electric company for green energy, or what the owner calls cow power. It allows us to have a zero carbon footprint. A lot of people don't know what cow power is, and when you first mention it to them, they think of cows on treadmills or things like that. In Vermont, six dairies now feed power generated from manure into the grid. It's a process that starts when the farmer feeds the cow waste to bacteria that digest it and release methane gas. The gas is burned inside an engine that turns a generator. Cow power is an attractive alternative energy source because the process pumps out electricity without burning fossil fuels that harm the environment. And the environmental benefits are not just about energy use. Livestock waste makes up almost 20% of greenhouse gas emissions worldwide, according to the United Nations, and methane is significantly more harmful to the environment than carbon dioxide. You take the methane gas out of the manure waste stream and that's not being released into the atmosphere, so you've reduced the carbon footprint for agriculture. Uh, you've also uh, supplied a couple of million kilowatts of electricity with no carbon footprint. The money's not so bad either. Raul says he took in $200,000 this year from cow power. But the process is still out of reach for many small farmers. Most dairies in Vermont have about 80 to 100 cows, and it typically takes about 800 to make the project viable. Farmers here are working to adapt the process so that it's possible with just 300 of the animals. 